And they're off. Lucky Jim is leaving from the outside. In focus, matches strides with him, and enough talk from the rail gets out well. So these three are across the track early. Settling fourth is Arch Madness as they head onto the turn. Then Big Boy Lloyd is racing in fifth, like a bat out of hell, backed off the gate in sixth. And Windsurfer trails the field. In focus to the lead. Lucky Jim is up to his wheel on the outside, working his way toward the front. Enough talk is right there, racing in third. Arch Madness fourth on the inside as Lucky Jim takes command. Opening quarter was quick and 20. 7 and 1 in focus off stride. In focus broke in that second spot. So Lucky Jim gets a big head start on the field. Enough talk about three and a half lengths away. Racing in second. A similar gap to Arch Madness in third. Big Boy Lloyd is fourth. It's two and a half lengths further back to like a bat out of hell. Windsurfer is chased in six. A costly break by In Focus, who's dropped out of it, trailing the field. So it's Lucky Jim who's setting the pace. Enough talk is caught up to him in that pocket spot. Racing in second. Arch Madness is third. 55 and 4 for the half mile split as they move on to the far turn. Big Boy Lloyd is fourth like a bat out of hell following in fifth and Windsurfer is sixth. Enough talk pops the pocket. Enough talk will attack Lucky Jim on the turn and Lucky Jim counters and quickens on the inside. Enough talk just half a length away coming toward the three quarter marker. Arch Madness about three lengths from the front is trotting third. Then Big Boy Lloyd fourth and it's Lucky Jim showing the way as they reach three quarters 123 and three. Enough talk on the outside is second as they come to the top of the stretch. Arch Madness is third and it's Lucky Jim who's two lengths in front. Enough talk has dropped back in behind with an eighth of a mile to go. Arch Madness trying to gain on the outside third but Lucky Jim leads it by two. Arch Madness on the outside now second. It's Lucky Jim. Arch Madness trying to get to his wheel. Lucky Jim almost there. Arch Madness coming. Lucky Jim wins the Sumac lad. Arch Madness second. Enough talk third and one. 51 and one. Enough talk has dropped back in behind with an eighth of a mile to go. Arch Madness trying to gain on the outside third, but Lucky Jim leads it by two. Arch Madness on the outside now second. It's Lucky Jim. Arch Madness trying to get to his wheel. Lucky Jim almost there. Arch Madness coming. Lucky Jim wins the Sumac lad. Arch Madness second. Enough talk third and one. 51 and one by SJ's photo out of Hawaiian Sierra by Sierra Cosmos, owned by David and John Prushnock of Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania, and Bill Gregg, also of Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania. Julie Miller trains three in a row tonight for Andy Miller, and this is the one that counts. Lucky Jim in the Sumac Lad final, and the results have been posted official. Lucky Jim's 16-race Big M winning streak was snapped by a neck a week ago, by enough talk in the second leg of the Sumac Lad, and he's back on beam tonight, 151 and one to take the final. Doug DeFrank, assistant racing secretary and timer, always has a stopwatch in his pocket. He's in the winner's circle to make the trophy presentation to the winning connections of Lucky Jim and Bob Hollywood Hayden with winner's circle reaction momentarily. Congratulations, Lucky Jim, 151 and one in the Sumac Lad.